Welcome to the deep end. Today we're counting down our picks for we list the five world's youngest billionaires. Before we begin, we publish new content every day, so be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. Number one, Kevin David Lehman. He's 18 years old, and his net worth is $3.3 billion. He began his career selling illegal drugs in pharmacies. He lives in Germany. He became the youngest billionaire in the world after inheriting the stakes of the German chemist chain DM. Drogery Markt. He inherited these stakes from his father, Gunnar Lehmann. Lehmann is now the world's youngest billionaire after he officially inherited his father's 50% stake in German drugstore chain Drogery Markt. Number 2. Wangs Long. Wang Zlong is a 24-year-old entrepreneur from China. His net worth is $1.5 billion. China's pigment manufacturing is his source of wealth. Wang inherited a stake worth more than $1.3 billion in CNNC Huayuan Titanium Dioxide Company, which trades on the Shenzhen Stock Exchange. The company produces titanium dioxide pigment, a white pigment that can be used in coatings, plastics, ink and other materials. Number 3. Alexandra Anderson Alexandra Anderson is 24 years old and she has $1.4 billion in net worth. She lives in Norway and she made her money from her investment firm. Anderson is the daughter of Norwegian industrialist Johan H. Anderson Jr., owner of Furnas, who in 2007, Transferred ownership stakes of 42.2% each to Alexandra and her sister Katerina. Number 4. Katerina Anderson Katerina Anderson is 25 years old. She has a net worth of $1.4 billion. Her wealth comes from her investment firm in Norway. The Anderson sisters each inherited 42% of Ferd, a Barham, Norway-based investment company that reels in about $2 billion in annual revenue. Their father, Johan, still runs the business. Number 5. Austin Russell Austin Russell is 26 years old. He has $2.4 billion in wealth. His wealth came from working with autonomous cars. He is from the United States. An optics prodigy, Russell dropped out of Stanford in 2012 after receiving a $100,000 deal fellowship to start Luminar Technologies, which makes sensors and other tech for autonomous vehicles. Its sensors now help self-driving cars of such customers as Volvo and Toyota by bouncing laser beams off nearby objects and vehicles surroundings. Luminar went public through a SPAC merger in December. Russell owns about a third of the company.